led by two women scientists, anything but heroes for the planet. The Sea to Source expedition is taking on the problem of plastics in our waterways, starting with the Ganges River, one of the world's holiest rivers, but sadly also one of the most polluted by plastics. So I'm the expedition co-lead for the Sea to Source project. And as part of that, I'm working with my colleague Jenna Jambeck to design the science to answer the questions about how plastic is getting into our major river systems around the world, how it moves through those systems, how it gets into the ocean, what impact it's having, and how do we change that? Heather and I working on this together as co-leads made sense because of our backgrounds and our fields, very complementary. Jenna and I both pulled together our teams and we looked at them and they're all women. They were the best of the best, but they just happened to all be women. That's been a great way to really show other women around the world that this can be done. And so that's what I hope that this can be an example of. We felt very strongly that this really tough, ambitious, uh, crazily beautiful thing that we call the Sea to Source Expedition, this was an opportunity to celebrate that anything's possible for women. Here are the stories of the women who are changing the world, fearlessly exploring uncharted territory, following in the footsteps of those who went before, and then stepping out into the unknown. Just Flash forward almost two decades, and Sea to Source Expedition co-leads Heather Caldaway and Jenna Jambeck have a new twist on balancing family and field work. For Jenna and I, we felt that it was an opportunity to, to set things up in a different way. A job share situation where we start and finish the expedition together, but in between we swap in and out. And by sharing the job, we can completely dedicate our time when we're here and then go back and, and see our family. 